What's happening people? Welcome to another video with All Source. We're back again with this iPhone 14 Pro Max uh, from Google Phone. This is the copy version if you didn't know. But if you don't follow me, make sure you follow me on one of the social medias above as I always put up sneak peeks on what to expect and all sorts. And as always, make sure you subscribe and also hit the bell notification so when I upload any video, you'll actually be notified. So here we have the 14 Pro Max. Um, if you want to see an unboxing and a little review of this phone, make sure you check out my previous video in this video today we are going to take a look at the camera uh, see what the quality is like and also we are going to do a teardown so first things first let's check the camera just in case once we do the teardown we might actually uh, destroy it from there so let's take a, a little video clip of the camera check out the quality of the photos and then we'll go straight into the phone and see what it's like inside let's take some footage of my mercedes and just give it a clean so yeah stability wise i'll leave that up to you zoom in let's give it a quick zoom in so i'm just actually walking to see what it's like so let's zoom into the wheel you have got a times three button but look at the pixels wow i'm pretty sure this is a 1.3 megapixel camera it's got a 10 times zoom but the colours are off. It looks really dull on screen, but I don't know what the sound quality is like. But judging by the screen, stability is not really good. Colours of the grass, it's much greener than this, don't worry. quality of the camera wasn't good and that is because it only has one camera lens uh, working the rest two are fake so that's why you only probably got a 1.3 megapixel camera or maybe even um less than that to be honest but anyways we don't need much when it comes to tear down of this fake iphone because they just glued the back panel on uh, that's what we're going to do so you don't need no heat and what we are going to do is i'm going to see if i can get a little gap into here and it's going to be that easy to get into it, hopefully. Well, first things first is, let's power this down. So as you can tell here, the glass is, well, the back is a glass, glass back. We did get, it is glass, as you can see. I don't want to get glass everywhere. There is a little of a gap and we've got it. So we've got into the phone, but as you can tell, we have destroyed the back, back glass. I think it's switched on again. I don't know why I'm doing this without gloves. But I'm trying to get my fingers, make sure my fingers are away from it. I'm pretty sure we got into it nearly. I don't want to pull out the blade too much just in case we uh, slice into my fingers. Oh, that's been destroyed. And I think we might have got into it, so. Wow, this is probably the uh, hardest I've, well, not really hard, but probably one of the hardest I've got into a fake, um, Goo phone because the other ones are pretty easy and some of them weren't even glued on together but this is a glass back and check that out I think I've actually destroyed some of there but no here we have the black back panel glass of course and you've got the big camera bezels here so let's put that aside 
and here we have it first of all I'm just gonna wipe down my desk as it's got glass or little pieces of glass all around let's take a look at the interior so they're all Phillips head screwdrivers so let's take all of these off So there we have it. As you can see, this bottom vibrator is connected to the circuit board, it's soldered on. Uh, they use a lot of soldering here when it comes to these fake phones. If you haven't seen my teardown video, make sure you check it out. But as you can see, it has a 3.85 volt battery. Uh, definitely not what it's advertised on the phone. And as you can see here, that is the SIM card uh, ejecting um, tray and here we have a micro SD card so you can add more memory you know it's a fake when you actually have a micro SD card so taking a look around pretty uh, basic uh, you've got your 0 0.3 megapixel front-facing camera right here uh, and yeah there we have it so that is the interior of this phone uh, I don't want to destroy it that much because I always do it in previous videos but let's not open it more because the components are just pretty basic to be honest uh, not really spectacular but if you want to see any other videos let me know in the comment section below anyways I hope you enjoyed this video uh, if you want to see any other shots of this phone let me know in the comment section below does it still work let's hold it in yes it does as you can see here this is only a black blackout uh, of the notch and you can see the front facing camera which is a punch hole camera behind and that's how they've done it when it comes to this notch so yeah i hope you enjoyed this video thanks for watching and i'll see you again for another video